hi guys welcome back to my channel today we are gonna do some jamaican slash caribbean blended seasoning you know so you can let that meat marinate properly um i will be using a blender today you can use a food processor whichever you have i do have a blender so that's what we're using i have my thingy it's clean my board is clean i just washed it and I do have these right here. We got some garlic. We got some pepper with scotch, hot pepper, they hot. Okay, these are from Jamaica, right? We have peppers. We got some ginger. You don't have to use ginger. I want to use ginger because I put ginger in everything. We have some um, scallion slash green onions. We have thyme. We have two big garlic, uh, sorry, onions. We have some pimento right there. So this is all that I'm using today. We are going to cut these up, wash them, and we are going to blend them. We're going to put it in a jar. We're going to have that for every time we're cooking. We can use some of this. And I just can't wait to finish and smell all of that. It smells so good. Before we start this video though, I want you guys to make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you like it, you know. I know some people do it different. You can go ahead and add whatever you want, but this is all I have. So this is what we're using right now. Um, yeah, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you like, subscribe, you know. And tell me what you use. Whatever you add, tell me what you add in the comment section below. Yo, DJ Okay guys, I'm gonna start off with this scallion and I did make the garlic right there. We have everything else in another dish over here. So we are gonna chop these up. Look at all that from the garlic and you know, other parts of it. But we're gonna start with the scallion first and I'm gonna show you guys how I cut it up and then we're gonna do the onions, everything is washed, so we can just prepare everything in the blender right there. Okay, guys, the first thing, I'm going to cut these off. This is the root. Oh, this smells so good. gonna pour this in this dish it's burning my eyes we have some right here that's it we are gonna split the onions So 
guys, we're going to cut the ginger as thin as we can. And I didn't peel it because most of the flavor is in the skin of the ginger. If you guys didn't know. You know, ginger is a little bit hard. So as thin as you can get it, that's better. If you can get it smaller, that's also fine. Yo, DJ, yo, DJ. All right, guys, so we are going to do the sign now, and we have it right here. What I'm going to do is cut the bottom off first because all the roots, the stem, is mostly at the bottom if you guys want to draw it off that's fine but I'm not gonna do that so I'm just gonna cut everything up all right so that's the time right there we have the scotch bonnet peppers uh, this is hot so you gotta be careful. These were in the freezer and that's the reason why they're like this. But for me, I have to be extremely careful because I have the baby. gonna leave this one we are then gonna cut these up the garlic just bust the bigger ones in two and that's it All right, guys, everything is all chopped up. I'm going to use some olive oil in it. I didn't tell you guys at first, but we're gonna use some olive oil. I have everything prepared, so we're just gonna start putting everything in the blender right here. This smells so good. Like I said, you guys can add whatever you wanna add. It's your choice, your preference. I did leave a piece of pepper. I have some chicken that I'm going to french fry and we're going to add the pepper to that. But this is it. it. Smells so good. It looks good. But it can't eat like this. Fresh. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> Alright guys, this smells so good. All 
right guys this is it i know some of the pimento is not blended but this is how i want it i'm just gonna stir it so everything you can see the pepper so it looks like a real seasoning see that all right, we are, and you guys, I add olive oil. You know, the onion will be spraying the water, so we didn't need to add any water. But I'm gonna pour it in this jar right here. Live, love, eat. You know, I no sense. There's onion, garlic, scallion, thyme, ginger. Uh, pepper, hot pepper. What else is in it? I don't remember. But this, if you're cooking, you're gonna put store it in the fridge. It lasts up to six months. And uh, I add some olive oil, so you can rub it on your meat, whatever meat you're cooking. You can use. Oh, it. any meat? Yeah, it's seasoning. It's not only meat for chicken or mm. fish or pork. Or beef. So this is it. It looks nice, huh? Yeah, and we have our blended season right there for the fridge. Alright guys, this is it. We're gonna store this in the fridge. It can last up to six months. So whatever meat you're gonna cook, you just add some. Maybe a big uh what you call that spoon? One of them big spoons you have in your kitchen. Yes, everybody have one of that. I rather store it in glass bottles. So if you don't have, you can purchase one. And um, yeah, it looks so juicy. So this is it. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel. If you guys want any video you can send me a message or leave it in the comment section until my next upload god is love and be safe mm -hmm.